Siècle Bain is a commune of 2000 on the French Moselle, about 10 kilometres from the German border. It's a delightful spot to watch trains entering and leaving France. It feels very similar to many of the communities along the river, all the way to its confluence at Koblenz. Our first train is eastbound, Fret SNCF Prima hauled. Not the prettiest locomotive, but these multi-system Alstom workhorses have proved reliable and were relatively cheap to buy. However, nearly all the 1,750 units sold are in France. The only export success has been in China, where 900 have been produced under licence. The eastbound train is carrying tarp wagons and general purpose SNCF sliding wall vans, normally used for paper products. These views of the river were taken from the ramparts of the Chateau des Ducs de la Reine. The origins of the castle are a little obscure, but that matters little to us. It's a wonderful platform for filming. Entry is a modest five euros. Haulage over the line seems pretty well split between SNCF and DB Schenker. DB utilised the same Trax MS Tri system machines as used by Eurocargo Rail. Indeed, many are from the same build programme allocated to the Bombardier Castle Works in 2009. The DB machines can naturally operate throughout Germany, but in practice they work French trains to and from Cologne, Saarbrücken, Mannheim and Offenburg. Their usual destination is Wuppi Classification Yard, but they work to Strasbourg and at least to Nancy, south of here. Their Euro Cargo Rail Tracks cousins work all the way to the Spanish border. Perhaps in time, they will reach Valencia. This Prima is heading towards Thionville. The coils being conveyed are on open wagons, no weather protection. These will be used by customers who wish to treat the material further, cleaning, coating, perhaps reducing the thickness to a specific gauge. Anyway, weather protection is not required and open wagons are cheaper.
Just before dusk, we catch another DB tracks westbound, this time with a wagon load. The mixed train has a good assortment of wagons, as a multi-customer train should, though most are related in one way or another to the metal sector. Thank you for travelling with Ticket to Ride in northeastern France. The journey continues in TTR 193 when we visit the largest city in Lorraine, Metz. We look at the city and its station. the LGV interconnection, France's busiest classification yard at Voipy, then follow the Moselle south to Nancy, where we look at a rather different urban transport solution. Do join us. Until then, it's bye for now.